I'm Chef Keith Snow. Welcome to Harvest Eating. I want to show you how to make leek cream. Very simple thing. Obviously, leeks and cream. And later on, you use it as a sauce. You can top grilled chicken. You can put it on steak. A little later, we're going to put it on a nice piece of mahi. It's a very simple recipe to have in your little tool bag. So let's uh, get right into it. What we've done is just finely sliced up some little leeks like this. Couldn't be simpler. Basically just the white part, it's about the first part. We've removed the stem and we've got about three or four inches off the white part. Now we've got a little Windsor pan here over about a medium heat. We're gonna take a little touch of pure olive oil and then get some of these leeks down in there. And the idea is just to cook these down. They're mostly water, so a lot of that, that aroma will come out. We'll turn on our fan. We'll season them up with a little bit of kosher salt and some black pepper, just like that. And these are gonna get a little caramelized, which is gonna bring a lot of flavor to the end. And then after they're cooked, what we'll do is we'll strain the leeks out. They'll give all their flavor to the cream and we'll strain them right out. It needs just a touch more oil. So now they're starting to pick up a little color. We're gonna deglaze this pan with just a touch of dry white wine and remove it from your flame. So you wanna evaporate out that liquid like that and now add your cream. And whenever I'm using a recipe that calls for cream, I like to use this Organic Valley. It's a great cream, it's totally organic. So this is what I use. Put that cream in there. We're gonna now re-season it a bit. We've added all that volume, so you've got to re-season. Some salt, more pepper, and then you're gonna turn the heat way down. And what's gonna happen is this cream is going to evaporate and cook down, and it's gonna pick up loads of beautiful leek flavor. We'll then strain it out, and we'll use it in another dish. I'll show you what it looks like in just a second. Okay, our leek cream has thickened up quite a bit. When you evaporate a lot of the water out of the cream, it tends to thicken up. We're now gonna strain it using just a simple strainer like this. Pour it right in there. Make sure we get all of it, it's good stuff. And then you wanna use the back of your spoon here and lift this up and force out as much of that cream as you possibly can. And that leek cream is great on any grilled item. It'd be a really sexy thing to eat on a nice uh, seared filet mignon. So that's it, we've got just about all of it out. Give that a try today, some beautiful leek cream.